بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم اسرائیل وار ٹو اسکلیٹ اٹس رسپانس ٹو این اٹیک بائی دا فلسطینین گروپ حماس ود اے گروپ آفینسو وائل یو ایس پریزیڈنٹ جو بڈن پلس سپورٹ فار اسرائیل اینڈ ایشوڈ اے وارننگ ٹو اینی ون ہو مائٹ سیک ٹو ٹیک ایڈوانٹیج آف دا سچویشن اسرائیل سیٹ ڈزنز آف اٹس فائٹر جیٹس اسٹرک مور دین ٹو ہنڈریڈ ٹارکیٹس اوور نائٹ آن وینسڈے ان اے نیبر ہوڈ آف گزا سٹی دیٹ اٹ کلیم ہیڈ بین یوز بائی ہماس ٹو لانچ اٹس ان پریزیڈنٹیڈ ویو آف اٹیکس Gaza's health ministry said at least 950 people have been killed and 5,000 injured in the crowded coastal enclave. Israel's military said that that toll in Israel had reached 1,200 and more than 2,700 people had been wounded. We have sustained extremely heavy casualties, military spokesperson Lieutenant Colonel Jonathan Conricker said in a video briefing on X, formerly known as Twitter. Hamas fighters holding Israeli soldiers and civilians hostage on Monday threatened to execute a captive for each home in Gaza head without warning. But as night fell on Tuesday, there was no indication they had done so. Israeli Defense Minister Yoav Gallant speaking to soldiers near the Gaza fence said, Hamas wanted a change and it will get on. What was in Gaza will no longer be. We started offensive from the air. Later on, we will also come from the ground. We have been controlling the area since day two, and we are on the offensive. It will only intensify. At least 1,000 fighters who had infiltrated from Gaza had been killed, the Israeli Haman newspaper claimed.